guys, Jen here, and I want to take you on a tour of one of me and Dave's new projects around the house. One thing I've really been passionate about, and as you guys get to know us and learn more about everybody in the old homestead, one of the things that I'm passionate about is this, saving the pollinators. And saving the bees is important, and just as important as that is saving the monarch butterflies. So I'm sure we all know what monarch butterflies look like. We know their familiar patterns and markings and colors. And many of us might not know that they are becoming extinct. Help save the monarch butterflies by planting some milkweed, getting some caterpillars, and letting them grow in a safe enclosure and watching these beautiful creatures just transform from these itty bitty caterpillars into these beautiful butterflies that not only teach us and help the planet but teach us how to love ourselves and how to grow into something beautiful like the butterfly. So I'm gonna show you the plants and then we're also gonna see Dave who the sweet man that he is is helping me with this dream by building me a butterfly enclosure. So let's take a look at the plants and then we will go into how to build a butterfly enclosure. Okay, so here we are. We're growing a lot of different plants in here, but these little guys back here are the milkweed. Look how tall this guy is. So we got a couple different kinds in here. There are different kinds of milkweed plants, but here we kind of got a mix of seeds and we're going to see how they grow. And they're growing pretty well. So once we're done with the potting stage here, we're going to take them, plant them into the ground in our enclosure, and then I'm going to go look for some butterfly caterpillar, monarch caterpillars to buy. We loosely put the frame together for the structure, um, but what we want to do is add a door and then screening, and obviously then we add the milkweed and butterflies, and we watch them grow. little guys are ready to be planted. Look how big they got. And David is finishing up the butterfly cage. Look how good it turned out. So it's got this netting on here so that nothing can come in and nothing can come out. So the butterflies will be protected and then here is where he's going to put a door on and then we will get planting. our first butterfly enclosure. We will keep you updated on the caterpillars and how they grow and how it works and we're excited to see what happens. If you would like to help save the monarch butterflies, please visit one of the websites we have in the description below. We can help save this beautiful species by donating, saving the habitat, or spreading the word.